Michelle Fink's beach looks like the place to be. Let's check mm -hmm. with Marquina Brown with a look at a forecast. Marquina? Yeah, I think the beach is probably number one on the list, but we've got lots of locations across the Southland that are really nice today. If you're taking a live look, you can see the skyline. Nothing going on. Sky condition wise, we're really clear and dry, and that is the way we're going to stay over the course of the next few days. And hot, too. Look at these temperatures. Van Nuys, you're at 96 degrees. We've got upper 90s in Ontario. Fullerton, current temperature 88 degrees. It is all because of this area of high pressure, clockwise flow around an area of high pressure. And because this thing will stick and stay, we will only get warmer and warmer as the days go on. All right. So as we take a look at what we're doing for highs tomorrow, 98 degrees will be the high in Valencia, 96 in Reseda. Along the coast there, we're looking at 70s, 75 for Long Beach, 83 for a high tomorrow in Anaheim, 96 in Pomona, Ontario, looking at a high tomorrow of 92 degrees. Everybody's going to be above average, really, no matter where you are. Montana looking at 93. We're just a skosh under 100 degrees for the folks in San Bernardino, while Riverside will see highs right around 95 degrees. So as we take a look at the seven-day forecast, what you'll notice is that we, again, not only get hotter and hotter, but the hottest day of the seven-day spread will be on Friday for just about everybody. Uh, beach communities tomorrow looking at about 73 degrees, but you jump up into the low 80s by the end of the week and into the weekend. Same story here for lots of folks. Again, it's going to be really warm for the folks in the valleys as we head toward Friday and Saturday. We're talking triple digit temperatures. For the Inland Empire, 97 is what you're going to do tomorrow, but by Friday, you're looking at 104. Look at all of the triple digit temperatures in store for the folks in the high deserts over the next several days. What they'll also need to be watching out for is that chance for isolated storm activity as well as we start to tap into some of that monsoonal moisture. So all in all, we get hotter and the sun sticks around. That's a look at what we're doing, guys. Back to you. We've been warned, Marquina. All right. Thank